hiking mountains, cascading waterfalls, pristine lakes, and steady flowing river streams make Black Forest a paradise for nature lovers. The Cuckoo Clocks and Black Forest Cakes are some of the popular products to have originated here. Welcome back to our channel. It's been really long time that we have seen each other. This time, I will directly take you through Black Forest. We spent two days exploring the landscape culture and history of this region. We started our day one from the town of Baden Baden, which is in the northern tip of Black Forest. We took the road 500 and drove from Baden Baden to the city of Triburg. Road 500 is a scenic route which is intended mainly as a tourist road. It has numerous panoramic viewpoints that offer sweeping views of the Black Forest's breathtaking landscapes. We make a stop at these points to capture the vastness of the forest. Within the few minutes into our drive, we were already in awe of the Black Forest. As we drove through the valleys of Black Forest, we felt a sense of enchantment. The lush green meadows in the backdrop of mountains made this one of our best drives. After two hours of drive, we reached Dryburg. Dryburg is surrounded by dense forests and nestled in the heart of the Black Forest. Dryburg is a hidden gem waiting to be discovered. As you wander through its charming streets, we are transported to a world where natural beauty and cultural heritage intervene. The highlight of Triburg is undoubtedly its magnificent waterfalls, cascading down a total of approximately 163 meters of height. The Triburg waterfalls are among the highest in Germany. As we hike along the well-maintained trails, the thunderous sound of water crashing against the rocks fills the air, creating a mesmerizing ambience. visited the largest cuckoo clock in the world. It took 5 years to create this clock. Local clockmakers Ewald and Ralph Abel showcased their mastery of the craft in the creation of this massive cuckoo clock. They followed century-old blueprints to build a clock using traditional black forest craftsmanship but 60 times the size. The dimensions are impressive. The clock is 15 feet tall and weighs 6 tons. The cuckoo itself weighs 330 pounds and the swinging pendulum is 26 feet long. In the evening, we took a stroll in the town of Black Forest and visited some souvenir shops. Day 2 Today we 
drive to Lake Titisi. Our drive from Triburg to Lake Titisi has been nothing short of a visual feast. From the winding roads and forested landscapes to the charming villages and panoramic views, we have witnessed the true essence of Black Forest. Now, as we arrive at the serene shores of Lake Titisi, it's time to embrace the tranquility and immerse ourselves in the beauty that nature has bestowed upon this enchanting destination. Lake Titisi caters to a wide range of recreational activities, ensuring there's something for everyone to enjoy. Adventure enthusiasts can indulge in water sports like kayaking, paddle boarding and sailing, while those seeking relaxation can take a leisurely boat ride or find a cozy spot to bask in the sun. Fishing enthusiasts can try their luck in the lake's abundant waters. And hikers can explore the scenic trails surrounding the lake. The peaceful atmosphere accompanied by the gentle lapping of the waves offers a soothing escape from the chaos of daily life. Lake Titisi, we drive to Freiburg. Now in the lively city of Freiburg, with its medieval charm, vibrant atmosphere and stunning architecture, Freiburg offers a unique blend of old world allure and modern vibrancy. The heart of Freiburg lies in its historic old town, with its well-preserved medieval architecture. The narrow, winding streets aligned with colourful buildings adorned with intricate details. The centrepiece of the old town is the impressive Freiburg Minster, a towering Gothic cathedral that dominates the skyline. Exploring the old town allows us to step back in time and appreciate the city's rich heritage. The Freiburg Minster is an architectural masterpiece that has stood tall for centuries. In the evening, we took a quiet walk in the beautiful town of Freiburg. A trip to Black Forest is of course not complete without the Black Forest cake. We had coffee with a piece of delicious Black Forest cake and headed back to Baden-Baden. That's all for this Black Forest trip for now and we will come back with another destination soon.